Now, I'm not going to tell you not to buy that Chanel fragrance, but before you do, watch this video. So I have outdone myself again. I have found the best, cheapest, longest lasting fragrance house. So I have been waiting to do this video, y'all. I am so excited to share with y'all these fragrances. These fragrances are bomb and they are only $10, y'all. I get mine from my local TJ Maxx, Marshalls. I have seen them in Burlington sometimes, but mostly I see them in TJ Maxx and Marshalls. Y'all, this fragrance house is bomb. It is beast mode and it is killer. And y'all, these fragrances are only $10. Only $10. Now, if you do purchase them off of the website, they are $49 and up. But I'm telling y'all, purchase them from TJ Maxx and Marshalls now because anytime fragrances get popular, you already know the price goes up. So you wanna make sure that you go ahead and get yours. Y'all, these fragrances are bomb. Let's get into so The it. fragrances I am going to be hauling today is from Jean Marc Paris. Y'all, he has the best, cheapest perfumes in the game. Y'all, these perfumes are really, really good. They are like luxury status. And I'm going to share with y'all my favorite. So I do have five fragrances from his whole entire collection. So I will be telling y'all which ones I absolutely love. Actually, I'm going to put them in order from my least favorite to my favorite favorite, y'all. And you do not want to miss out on this video. So before I show you all of the fragrances, y'all, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also hit that little bell so you'll be notified anytime your girl uploads a video and like the video y'all it helps me out tremendously please like the video people like the video so let's start off with our number five fragrance so this is my least liked fragrance out of this collection this is the sugar pop fragrance i actually found this one on clearance for 450 at burlington so you can find some of his scents at burlington's as well now, the only reason why I don't like this fragrance is because it is a straight dupe for pink sugar. If you are not new to my channel, then you already know I do not like pink sugar. It is just not my thing. But hey, if you like pink sugar, girl, let me tell you, get this sugar pop. So if you do not want to spend your coin on pink sugar, y'all get this sugar pop y'all this smells exactly like pink sugar and honestly y'all i just got it to complete my collection i am not a pink sugar girl but this literally smells exactly like pink sugar he does have a spinoff to this one it's the sugar pop cotton candy i will leave a picture of that one right here but y'all if you, i'm telling you if you like pink sugar this is pink sugar in a bottle let's get into the fragrance notes y'all because y'all already know i love a good fragrance note um the fragrance type is gramond floral the top notes is melted sugar wild berry citrus accord middle notes are wild jasmine passion flower peony the heart is vanilla creme de br br brulee okay girl sandalwood canned almonds y'all this smells exactly like pink sugar y'all my phone was about to fall this one smells exactly like pink sugar that's why this one is my number five just because i'm not really a pink sugar girl i mean she smells okay but i am not a big fan of pink sugar i think too many people have that fragrance but hey if you love pink sugar then get this. so coming in at number four would have to be femme noir now i have a love for soft feminine perfumes y'all i'm gonna have a whole video on feminine fragrances i absolutely love this scent y'all i've used so much of this i don't even think y'all can see because i'm kind of getting washed out but i've used so much of this fragrance definitely gives me dainty feminine vibes y'all at first i was not a lover of this perfume because i'm used to just heavy hitters so y'all know i am obsessed with heavy hitter fragrances this one is not a heavy hitter this one is very soft very dainty very ladylike i love this i think this is one of the best 
feminine scents on the market and y'all this bottle is a 3.4 ounce bottle and it was ten dollars on their website this is 59 dollars, y'all 59 dollars. i absolutely love this one let's get into the fragrance note so the fragrance type is floriental the top notes is red berries and citrus the middle notes is black orchid patchouli pink pink sweet rose the heart is french vanilla vetiver and then sandalwood y'all this one is very soft feminine and also mysterious i really do like this one i think this is just y'all this one this one is so so slept on and let me tell y'all i was sleeping on this fragrance and i actually got two bottles y'all this is how you know his fragrances are bomb because i literally have two bottles of the same fragrance i have really been loving the soft feminine fragrances now this one does last all day but it's not like a pungent um heavy hitter scent like if you pass by somebody they can definitely smell you but it's not like a strong scent like as soon as you walk in the room everybody's not going to smell you but if they pass by you they're going to be like oh she smells really really good and this is just a nice feminine scent y'all i literally have two bottles fragrance y'all i have been into more feminine soft scents as well i do have a lot of heavy hitters but y'all i'm gonna be honest with y'all i love all types of perfume and this one just makes me feel really really girly now i can say this one is best used in the summer springtime i would definitely say the springtime this would be just a great great perfume to wear because the springtime it's all about that feminine energy y'all it's all about that feminine energy i love this perfume and they're only ten dollars y'all i keep stressing that these get popular on youtube the price is definitely going to go up so make sure you check them out now because i haven't heard anybody talk about these fragrances and honestly y'all these fragrances are so freaking good like get your hands on them now y'all remember when shagav oud hit youtube and now the price has definitely went up for that perfume so make sure you get your hands on it now before the price goes up so this is the next fragrance this is flare paris rose and honestly y'all i am on a hunt for another one of these perfumes this one was ten dollars as well and this is actually a 1.7 fluid ounce bottle this one i've only seen in the 1.7 ounce bottle i love the pink packaging for this one the box is just so freaking cute to me so this one definitely had to make top three honestly y'all this one if i didn't like the other two so much this one would definitely been have been my number one y'all this one smells really really good if you love rose y'all know i have been into rose since lately i definitely think you should try this one this one smells so good and it's not like a stinky rose it's a sweet sweet rose y'all the sweet rose is just everything in this perfume does have a bit of champagneiness to it and it makes this perfume just smell so so good y'all this is a great floral i love this scent it's very again i would i would say feminine as well this is very feminine but you can definitely wear this on date night uh, i need to do a video on my favorite date night scents because this would definitely be great for a date night even during the daytime this will be a really good perfume definitely if you go on a nice brunch date girl this rose smells amazing the website this one is actually 49 dollars for the 1.7 fluid ounce bottle so y'all make sure you i'm telling y'all don't sleep on these fragrances go to tj maxx go to marshall's and get them for ten dollars girl because they are amazing so they describe this scent as central feminine and romantic and i definitely would have to agree if you love a good rose girl you need this in your collection okay the fragrance type is floriental the top notes is champagne i told y'all it had a little champagniness to it french black currant and citrus the middle notes is patchouli passion flower jasmine the heart is sandalwood amber and green vetiver y'all this one smells so good 
definitely a nice romantic scent y'all you need this one if you are a rose lover like me at first i really did not care for rose but i'm gonna be honest with y'all this scent and the paris hilton um rose rush they just made me fall in love with rose y'all and this one smells so good i have to get me another bottle of this one because i really do love this one this is perfect perfect for a date so coming in at number two and y'all this was a hard decision because i love the last three honestly y'all could be the top one honestly i just had to make a decision but i love this fragrance as well this is flair paris this is a straight chanel dupe now on the website i did see people saying that this is a dupe for chanel number five Y'all know I absolutely hate Chanel fragrances, but let me say this. This is Chanel done better than Chanel. You know that this is a Chanel dupe. This immediately when I smelled this, I didn't even read any reviews. I knew that this was a Chanel dupe. It's very soapy. This is very clean. Um, I cannot stand Chanel number no. five. I cannot stand Chanel fragrances in general. All of them just smell very stink to me. Even the ones that people say smell sweet, they just all stink to me. This one is giving what Chanel should have given. And the bottle for this one is literally, it's it screams Chanel dupe. This is a straight Chanel dupe. Um, I think when you smell Chanel fragrances, you kind of know that it's Chanel, but not in a good way. This honestly is Chanel done right. Honestly, Chanel, take notes from Jean Marc Paris. This is how Chanel is supposed to smell. This smells very clean and very soapy. Now, I will say longevity on all of the fragrances is amazing especially this one this one can last all day literally from eight in the morning to eight at night this one is so so good i actually wore this one on my birthday and this one was my first fragrance from his collection and it made me fall in love with his collection this lasts all day and night you do not need that many sprays the first time i wore this i sprayed about five sprays and honestly i regretted it because i was just too too potent it was just too loud honestly you can go in from anywhere between one to three sprays i spray at least three sprays and that's it i've worn this about three times and y'all know i'm a heavy sprayer but you cannot go heavy with this because this lasts all day it's very 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 soapy it's very fresh this is a great Chanel dupe. So this fragrance is actually $59, y'all. This fragrance is $60 on his website. Um, y'all, go and get this one. If you want a soapy scent that's gonna last all day, get this one. My problem with fresh scents and soapy scents, they really don't last all day, but y'all, this one does. This scent is described as a sensual, feminine, and heady scent, okay. So the fragrance type for this one is flor floral oriental. The top notes is fresh bergamot, osmanthus, I can't say it, citrus. The middle notes is fresh gardenia, fresh rose, jasmine. The heart is French vanilla, spiced cinnamon, and myrrh. Honestly, y'all, I just smell fresh floral, fresh floral soapy. I just get soapy out of this. If I had to describe this, it would be straight soapy, y'all. This one smells amazing, amazing, amazing. And honestly, y'all, before I did this video, I was like, I have to get, like, backups. So, y'all, I have backups for, what, three of these perfumes, and I need a backup for the rose one. Y'all, I already have a backup because I already know once this video goes up other people's gonna make videos and then it's just gonna the the price is gonna skyrocket these are already going for like 30 35 dollars on um ebay y'all i'm telling you 
I'm telling you, y'all better get them now because they're already going up because they're so good, y'all. Do not be fooled. I know some people don't like cheap fragrances, but these are just amazing, y'all. Straight Chanel dupe. Smells better than Chanel, in my opinion. Um, very soapy. If you want a soapy scent that lasts forever, y'all get this so one. Coming in at our number one spot would have to be Flair Paris noir i have two bottles of this and i need about five this is the 1.7 fluid ounce bottle i think this one only comes in the 1.7 ounce bottle if you see this y'all run and get it this is an addicting scent this one smells honestly y'all top tier this smells like a straight luxury fragrance and i am going to be honest with y'all if i had to keep 10 perfumes for life this would definitely be in my top 10. this one smells amazing this one smells so sweet so seductive but also powdery at the same time i can already smell i haven't looked at the fragrance notes but i can already i can smell that this has coffee in it or um actually tonka bean i think this has tonka bean in it and some chocolatey notes y'all this one smells amazing honestly this one do y'all see how much i've used i've used a good bit of this y'all and i have so many fragrances in my collection i'm telling y'all if you don't get any fragrance out of this whole haul video make sure you get this one this one this is that one y'all i literally love this fragrance. this fragrance is described as a sensual mysterious and addictive fragrance the fragrance type is floriental fruity the top notes is french chocolate i told y'all it was some chocolate in here um blackberries basil the middle notes is mandarin mandarin um raspberry and french rose oh my god french rose y'all the heart is patchouli tonka bean and, and angelic seed this one smells amazing if i had honestly this one would be in my top five favorite fragrances period top five this one smells amazing this one smells so good y'all like this one can hang with the big dogs like i love all of his fragrances but this one y'all i already have a backup i already have a backup and i need a backup for the backup because i think i am going to get like two more bottles of these fragrances just because this one i love so much and i don't believe they make this one in the 3.4 ounce bottle i think they just make it in the 1.7 ounce bottle but guess what girl it's okay because i'm gonna go and get two more before i upload this video this one smells amazing i'm telling y'all if i had to pick five fragrances out of my collection this would be in my top five it's very sweet to me you do get that chocolate that tonka and you get floral as well do get a little bit of powderiness once this kind of dries down it's kind of weird y'all this smells amazing this is blended very very well this will be my number one fragrance out of his whole entire collection I had to suggest only three fragrances it would definitely be flare paris um flare paris rose and also Flair Paris Noir. This one is my absolute favorite, enough said. As you can see, I have backups to almost all of these fragrances. So you already know these fragrances are just bomb. Check out your local Marshalls, TJ Maxx, and Burlington for these fragrances. I'm telling you, pick them up. One thing I do love about buying fragrances from discounted stores, if I don't like them, I can return them. But trust me, girl, if you purchase any of the fragrances that I have talked about today, you are going to fall in love, okay? In love, girl. And the longevity on these fragrances are absolutely great. They are great. So that is it for this video. I hope you really enjoyed this video. I'm trying to give y'all more 
affordable options and honestly y'all these are not even on the level of affordable fragrances these fragrances are on the level of luxury fragrances y'all they smell so good the longevity is just amazing so y'all do not sleep on this brand this is the jean mark paris brand do not sleep on them remember pink fluff did a review first okay don't forget it don't forget it so if you have made it to the end of this video y'all make sure you hit that subscribe button don't forget to hit that like button as well and i will see you on my next video